Hello, this is John from caveofprogramming.com and in this tutorial we're going to look at publishing your application in the Google Store. Now I've already exported and digitally signed my application and I've created screenshots of it and I've also created a few other graphics that you'll need and you can see what those are when you go to the actual page um, where you can upload your application. But in particular, among other things, you'll need a, at the moment a 512 by 512 very large um, version of your icons application to use in the store, I suppose. So let's go to market.android.com slash publish. And you need to create a developer account. And if you go to this page for the first time, it will give you, it will ask you if you want to create an account and you'll need to pay 25 US dollars to create an account but once you've created a developer account you can upload as many applications as you want uh, and you don't have to pay 25 dollars again. So I've already created my developer account and I've paid my 25 US dollars and now I'm going to go to upload application here on this page and I'll select my APK which I exported in the last tutorial, my Note Squirrel APK containing my application, and I'll click Upload. And I'm just going to come back in a second when that's finished. Okay, so I've now uploaded my APK file, and I get this screen, and it warns me that I've my app requests two permissions and requests two features that will be used to filter it. So these are the permissions and the uses feature nodes that we talked about earlier. And as long as there are no horrible warnings here, you can click save and then upload stuff here. Um, so it's a great big form and uh, I won't go through this because you can, it explains uh, what you need to upload. And you'll need screenshots and a high resolution application icon, uh, 512 by 512 and fill in a bunch of information. And when you've finished, then you can go ahead and try to save it and publish it. So I'll do that now and I'll come back very shortly. Okay, so I've filled in the details for my application and I just want to draw your attention to a couple of things in this page here. And one thing is you'll notice that you can, I've said that my application will be free because it's just a demo application basically. If you want to sell it, you need to set up a merchant account here and um, you probably won't get lots and lots of installs of your application unless you promote it yourself so if you do make an application you probably want to think about maybe creating a, a website or even creating videos for YouTube and sharing it on social kind of networks and things like that and uh, another thing is that if you look at this text here this uh, Google will actually filter your device depending on your permission settings um, and if this says zero just make sure that you haven't set some crazy permissions in your application and also make sure that you've uploaded an APK file and you need to click, click a link in here somewhere to activate it which has now disappeared because I have activated this but I think it was originally on this page so make sure you've uploaded an APK and you've activated it and then save and this says you know once you've set the price to free you can't change it again apparently and once you've done that you should see that your application is available to more than zero devices so let's just search for devices in here and this says this is available to 1595 devices which is surprisingly small actually but um, Actually, no, it's not surprisingly large because uh, when you look at the, these are not um, individual people. These are actual different kinds of devices, of course. So, yeah. Um, okay, and once you've done that, hopefully you can publish it. So I'll go ahead and do that. And I'll be back in just a minute. Let me get rid of this dialog. And to publish it, all you need to do is click this publish button here and say that you understand and I've got some errors as I expected so I'll correct those and be back shortly. Okay I'm back again and 
now I've successfully published my application the only thing I forgot was to tip check the box to say that I didn't uh, want to publish a privacy policy and the form warned me of that when I tried to click publish and so now um, I've got a published application and I'm not expecting to get rid of it because it is just a little demo app and I'm not planning to publicize it except in these tutorials and I will upload the full source code for this application and all the source code that you've seen in these tutorials um, along with the lectures so you'll be able to find them um, connected to this series of tutorials somewhere okay so that's it for this time and I hope you get rich with your application if you publish it and oh, oh yeah I should mention as well that if you don't charge money for your application you can also integrate advertising into it and make money that way but I'm just publishing this app for the fun of it and for this tutorial series really. Okay, so until next time, happy coding.